the final stage of the Jayco Herald Sun Tour, 122 kilometres around the Mornington Peninsula, starting and finishing at the top of Arthur's Seat, a climb they had to ascend three times. At the start of the stage, Peter Kenyak wearing the yellow jersey, 13 seconds clear of his teammate Chris Broom. The first time up the climb, and it was Chris Harper trying to take the points in the race for the budget Fort Lifts King of the Mountains classification, but it was Froome who got the better of him to move into the lead for the race on that jersey. Peter Kenyak with the yellow jersey was looking comfortable in the support of his teammates and as they hit the climb for the penultimate time it was Ian Boswell setting the pace. Coming to the top and it was Froome looking for more points in the race for the King of the Mounts classification opening up a small gap on the peloton which was enough to launch Joe Cooper off the front. The New Zealander riding for Avanti Iso Way Sport was hoping to move himself from 10th place overall up onto the podium. As they hit the bottom of the climb for the final time, Kenyak was seeing the yellow jersey slip through his fingers as Froome started doing what he does best. As soon as they hit the bottom of the climb, Cooper let go of Froome and it was the dual winner of the Tour de France who was launching his bid for victory. Behind him, the battle was on for a place on the podium, and it was Damien Housen from Orica Green Edge who was hoping that he had enough to move from fifth place up into the top three. Froome won the stage, and it was enough to move him into yellow. The clock then started for the minor placings. Keeping company with one of the locals, Jonathan Clark, it was Housen who launched his sprint for second place on the stage, and in the end, it was enough for Housen to climb up into third place in the overall standings. For Peter Kenyak, having started the day in the yellow jersey, he slipped away to second position overall, but it was a 1-2 for Team Sky. Froome going out the winner, Kenyak in second position, Damien Housen rounding out the podium. For Chris Froome, the perfect start to the season as he aims to win the Tour de France for a third time and then look forward to the Olympic Games in Rio. What does it mean to get away so well in the season? Yeah, it's amazing. Amazing feeling. I mean, um, put in a lot of hard, hard yards this winter, which hasn't been easy, obviously, with, with the new family starting and everything back home. So, um, yeah, massive, massive thank you to my family for, for giving me the support that I need to be able to do this job. Um, but again, I mean, more than that, also a massive thank you to, to the team. They gave me the all clear today. Um, up the second time, up off the seat. It was a little bit of a, an attack that went for, uh, I went for the King of the Mountain points. I just uh, sat on uh, the, the Avanti rider who attacked there. Um, and on the radio, the guys behind said, listen, great, we're not going to pull. You're in a perfect place to win the stage. Go for it for me.